unfortunately also we had a tragic ending at our air and space expo this weekend uh, there was an aircraft accident during Sunday's performance that resulted in the death of pilot Charles T. Chuck Coleman. Today we are learning more about the highly experienced pilot who died in a crash during an air show in Las Cruces over the weekend. KFOX 14 News at 9's Ariana Para in Las Cruces with more on the investigation into that deadly crash. Well, today we are learning that Chuck Coleman was the pilot who died during yesterday's air show here at the Las Cruces International Airport. Today I was able to talk to a colleague and friend of Chuck's who says that he will be missed not only by the aviation community, but by all who enjoyed entertainment. He was one of the most skilled pilots out there. And I think what this loss represents is, is really the loss of a mentor, the loss of a friend. Christopher Van Pelt met Chuck Coleman back in 2010. The two worked together in California and have been friends ever since. We spent a whole lot of time together. Uh, I can't even count how many hours we spent in the air together. Coleman died unexpectedly Sunday afternoon while performing at a Las Cruces Air and Space Expo. I heard the news yesterday from a friend who is a fellow pilot. Coleman speaking briefly about his excitement for the show just two days before the crash. And it's going to be a great event with this. Look at the, the sky you have here in New Mexico. Just spectacular type of thing. You know, it's hard to articulate. He was very skilled and also very talented. Um, but, you know, when you're riding the razor's edge, this sort of thing can happen no matter how good you are. Now Van Pelt says he's remembering Coleman not only as a great pilot. Flying for him was every single day. He was very polished. But the type of person he was. The quality of Chuck that stands out the most was just how generous he was with the resources that he had. That among his impressive list of accolades. His resume was, you know, like the, the height of the size of my body, pretty much. He got to work on a just a ton of fascinating things. One of the most memorable, being recruited to be a flight instructor for actors like Miles Teller in the movie Top Gun Maverick. Yeah, that was something that he really got a kick out of, just giving them really their first experience before they went off to, to film the movie. Van Pelt, along with many others, remembering Coleman's legacy, he now leaves behind. He was loved and respected by many and had an enormous friend group, and he's going to be very, very sorely missed. Well, the Las Cruces International Airport will remain closed while the National Transportation Safety Board, along with the Federal Aviation Administration, continue their investigation of this crash. For now, reporting in Las Cruces, I'm Ariana Barra.